Diesel Power Products headquarters, one of our favorite builds, the Raptor Super Duty. It's time for her to go under the knife again. Time for some horsepower upgrades courtesy of BD Diesel Performance. All right, here we are, Diesel Power Products World Headquarters. We're in the shop. Got the Raptor Super Duty here. We're ready to go all Ginsu on that engine compartment to give her some horse ponies. Um, what we got on the table here is the BD Diesel Performance 2011 to 14 Scorpion <laughs> Turbo Kit. Um, I got Johnny Kitson here from BD Diesel Performance. Mm -hmm. uh, why don't you give us a couple of specs, maybe on this uh, big old lung right here. Well, we're going with a S467 turbo, Borg Warner unit. Uh, 83 turbine with a 0.9 turbine housing. Should spool up real nice. Daily drive, tow your load, whatever you want to do. Um, this is a, an extremely thorough kit, and I'm not talking about just basic little um, elbows and things like that. You guys really spent some time here casting some pieces that look like uh, in the initial stuff are going to fit quite nicely. And, and it looks like you were trying to be considerate about cost too, so you reuse some of the factory stuff. Yeah. Um, you replace only the passenger side exhaust manifold. That's right. And this uh, has the uh, turbo mount uh, incorporated into it as well. Yeah. Um, new crossover pipe. It, it's a beautiful looking piece. That's all stainless. Yes, it is. And then some new cast intake uh, manifolds as well. Yes. Um, we're excited to put this to, to the test, see what the install is like. We're going to try things a little bit differently. Most people uh, pull the cab off. We're going to see if it's something maybe the uh, at-home guy could tackle in his driveway and do it with the cab on. Mm. At least I fit everywhere. <laughs> Stay tuned for more. Dieselpowerproducts.com. Booyah. Um, as you can see, we found the uh, valley in the motor, uh, which means we're kind of at the uh, tipping point. We're really pondering going back on with this turbo, the stock one that is. Um, no, I'm kidding. Not even a little bit do we want to do that, but yeah, we fit this big bad space right here. Ah, as you can tell. Cab is still on the truck and the turbo has been removed. So in the instructions, the kit mentions uh, to uh, test fit the crossover pipe so that we can modify that trans dipstick. Um, just a just a skosh of an adjustment. So I'm gonna go ahead and throw this sucker in there and kind of line things up and check her out. Just wrapped up the uh, turbo install on the Raptor Super Duty here. Fit and finish is perfect, uh, up there with the best that we've installed. Um, I'd like to thank BD Diesel for coming on down, giving us a hand. No problem at all. Going over some of the finer points here. Also talking with the guy who helped engineer this. Uh, it's pretty interesting to get the background story on how good the R&D is on this. How long was this kit in the works for? Oh, geez, I would say probably a good year or so. 
So before you wanted to release it to the public, you wanted to make sure every aspect of it was mm -hmm. dialed in, fit, finish, yeah. no matter what. We test fitted every part on our own truck, made sure it was dialed in before we released it to the Any public. Any revisions from version 1.0 to this one? Not really. We, we nailed it pretty good, I think, along the way. We just took our time and made sure it was right. Well, the install was relatively straightforward. The fact that you can do this install in your own driveway on your own time is uh, kind of a plus, no pulling the cab. Uh, it does get a little bit tight, but uh, completely doable. And I'm a little guy, so take that for whatever you want. Um, Drivability wise, compared to the stock turbo, night and day different. We were using the Easy Link software, uh, deleted the uh, VGT controlled turbo, and then went to level four. And to tell you the truth, level four, which is the highest setting they have, could easily be daily driven. Like, they need to come out with a level five, we'll call it fun time. Booyah. <laughs> Thanks for coming down. For more information on these products, get back to us at dieselpowerproducts.com. <laughs>